Hi, my name is Michelle Castleberry. I'm responsible for growth and content with uh, Vera PCS, the patient communication simulator. We're here at IMSH 2019 and we're exposing Vera to a much wider audience. Vera is your digital patient set in virtual reality. She's on the Oculus platform at the moment, so you wear a headset and you meet Vera. Um, Vera is a digital patient. She uh, has is different from your regular, I guess, virtual reality patients in the sense that she also has artificial intelligence. So using Google uh, Speech API, she has voice uh, recognition and response. So Vera can listen to the question you're asking and then can synthesize uh, her answer. So for example, you might ask Vera, what brings you to the office today? And Vera will respond, well, I'm here for, um, I'm here for headaches or I've been having headaches these last two weeks. Um, can you tell me more about that? Can you describe the headaches? Do the headaches move anywhere? Do you have any associated symptoms with those headaches? So these are the types of interview questions that your learners can practice in virtual reality, fully immersed with Vera. Vera has a self-assessment capability. So um, you as the faculty member would set the objectives. Um, uh, what percentage perhaps of the history of present illness or past medical social history do you want your learners to ask? Then of course um, you would log in, you see a transcript exactly of what your student asked and what, your, uh, what Vera's response was. Um, Vera is a cloud-based uh, software as well, so you log in using your device of choice. Um, as you can see here, here is the assessment component of Vera, the self-assessment. Um, here's a learner session, so we can see, um, again, what the learner asked. Um, and how Vera responded. Uh, and so these components are all uh, kind of criteria um, of objectives that you as the faculty member can, can set. Um, so here you see, um, you know, basically the timeline, what order the questions were asked in, what questions she has. Um, you know, we've got patient files, assessment logs, and then of course a checklist. She needs to complete a checklist as well.